All right, welcome back. So we're going to do some more tips and tricks today, but plus a build video. I have been asked how I made this bridge right here. It's not actually a bridge, but I, I get it. It does look bridge-like. So I'm going to show you how to build that today. I'm going to show you how, how you do this little highway bit. Um, it's actually very easy. I'm going to show you how you build a wall that it looks impenetrable. That's also very easy. And a few little more bits and bobs. There will be timestamps. I'll put timestamps and label them based off of what we're showing you on each thing. Yeah, so as I'm building up my city, and, and some of you have seen this before. This is my city. This is your main street. This is downtown that has the the actual Cyberpunk 2077 things. Now, all this is test. All that back there is testing. And I do a lot of my testing over here as well out of sight. You can see some of the things that I have been working on, like the signs that stick out from the building. Transparent PNGs, like literally transparent because you can't see billboard. Got the Baddies Hotel from Cyberpunk. That one doesn't work real good, if I'm being honest. But some cool stuff. You've got a little open sign right down here. Very cool. I love the arrows. I'll, I've got some of this already on my Patreon, but I'll be adding more. All of these are on the Patreon. I'm going to be putting them in sets, you know, sets of like uh, side signs, uh, cyberpunk, dread, idiocracy, you name it. So let's get to this and let's us make a bridge. So what I did with this, it's what a lot of people do, is this is just the alpha building. And on the alpha building, I placed these guys. Right? So this is how you would set up. So this is an alpha building right here. I just left it at its lowest level. And you would set these up. And the way I did it is so that I set it just right here. Oh, I'm too close to the edge. All right, that's fine. You can see that it is directional when I turn it. See how the traffic moves and the bulk of it goes one side versus the other. There's actually a red and an amber color down there. So it looks like the majority of the traffic is going this way. I do wish that Matt would change it to where it's literally directional, as in traffic lanes flow in one direction one way and the other direction the other way. I like that idea better than having just a single, or maybe there's a new one that is only directional. That'd be cool. So we are going to build this jobby up here. I, I was thinking so as, as I'm doing this, you know, slums are going to be over here. Uh, I think it's perfect because they don't have direct access to the niceties of downtown. It keeps them out of the way of all the uh, fancy clientele. And they're on the other side of the highway. It's kind of grim and bleak. And you come over here as, as you come out the highway, you know, you've got your little force field this is supposed to be don't enter here go there you know danger you're going out into the badlands kind of thing and we want i wanted to build another one of these because i'm going to put something similar here like now leaving night city come again or i don't know something like that so we're going to come up we're going to grab low town to get to the building that we need there it is right there you can tell because it's got these lights on it right it's got the and we're going to go all the way to the top. And I should hit Alt and build two of them, but I didn't, so we're going to have to do it again. All right. So the way I did this, you want snapping on it first. And if you look at this, you can see how it almost looks like it's bust buttressed on the sides, which just looks perfect. So you just turn it. Nope, this way. So it's like that, right? You're going to turn it so that the... I don't know, the extra bulk sits to the outside. Now, next thing we need to do is we need to grab the medium landscape. One thing to note here, and I'll come back and I'll show you on this, this line in the middle gets in the way. So you can either go down, but that's a little too low, they're going to fly through the sign, or go up. I chose to go up, so we're going to go up on this and we're going to go... Yeah, just center it, whatever, it's up to you. Until it just goes on there, boom. Well, 
like that. All right, so let's get in it. Yep, that ought to work. So now we're going to start with snapping on, and we're going to find the point that we want. All right, so so that's about the point that we want. So we first hit Z to correct. All right. So now we're at the area that's going to give us the exact line. Here's the hard part. Now is when we turn snapping off and you start getting a little twitchy because you're like, oh god, it's not going to be perfect. Well, we kind of just kind of drag her in there till it's about centered-ish. Something like that. Come on. We'll do the same thing here. We're going to get as close as we can. And you can see I went a little bit too far back. So this is where uh, those of you who have OCD are gonna gonna cringe a little bit because it's a little tough. Honestly, that's a pretty damn good job right there. So let's see how good of a job. Let's change back over here and let's put a sign up. I know you can't see what I'm doing, but uh, I'm going to my split screen and trying to find a uh, a good road sign to put up here. All right, for right now, we're going to put something a little more realistic. These are road signs that I have created by taking signs I see online and then cutting them out in transparent PNGs. So, now we have a really cool extra one that at some point, I don't actually have a sign available for me right now to be like, you're now leaving Night City, blah, 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 blah. But yeah, that works very well. Looks like I have a bridge here and gives me an extra place for a sign. Fantastic. So now let's show you how you do a wall. So when you do a wall you're gonna want the Alpha Corp building and you want snapping on. So you're putting it edge to edge here. Don't worry about the gap. I'll show you what happens in a minute. And don't worry about any of this stuff. I like to have the bow tie together but it, it's not going to matter because you can turn them later. So let's go that far. That's good enough. And that actually worked out perfect because it did exactly how I wanted to do anyway. We're going to bring these up one. Now you can go up further if you want. Makes it a little harder because you got more buildings you have to deal with. You might have to do an extra building down low just to be able to get the wall. But if you want a wall that's more impressive, yeah, by all means, bring it up even higher. So still on snapping, I'm just going to take this. I'm going to shove it in the middle there. So right now, if you can see... There's a hole. Doesn't look like a wall with a big hole in it, right? Now it looks like a wall. And this doesn't matter. You just stick it in there so that it covers. And if it's not covering, you can snap it in there. I see there's a little bit of a gap. We'll come back to that gap. All right. So there's a few of them with just a little bit of a gap. What we're going to do. Just kind of do that. You know, just just move her around just a little bit. Nope, wrong one. Hit Z. That one. There we go. Where was the other one? Right. There's one there. Wrong way. Nope. Z. There it is. All right gaps are covered so now you have your little wall and essentially what I do with things like this this is the reason I like doing snapping so I like to have these buttressed on uh, an exit so this is like a gate right your exit to the outer world so that's what a new eating building I think nope I like that's a central BD uh, sometimes it's hard to tell. There it is. So, if I were to bring this up just... Let's see. Yeah, I think that works. So we're going to take this. 
And because I put snapping on, watch what happens when I drag this over here, if I wanted to make another one of those. It just fits perfectly. It fits exactly like it wanted to. So you could have these running along and maybe this each one of these is your tower to protect the outer world and this is your corner tower kind of thing. So it actually works really cool. Uh, yeah, that, that makes me nervous. There we go. If you are new to the game, check out the Discord. We talk about all this kind of stuff every day. We're always pushing the limits of what we can come up with. There are some... I will show you actually real quick because I think it's a great idea. There are... A f I say us. There are a few people that are working on coming up with transparent video. It is a very difficult challenge to come up with, but it is working. And I'll show you one. How cool is that? Uh, Hamster was the first one to figure it out. Now, transparent video is a thing, but it's QuickTime, and QuickTime doesn't work on these billboards as of yet. And they're massive files anyway, so it would cause some serious problems with your game. You can't see it until that explosion goes off. It's fantastic. There's another one. Let me... Where is that? Here's the other one. Actually, I should put that up there. I will put that up there so you can see it. Right now, there is a black bar behind there because it does not have a transparent background. And now it does. It's outstanding. They did a really good job coming up with it. I ha It's been hurting my brain trying to figure it out, I'm not going to lie. I'm much better at photo editing than I am at video. But that's perfect. It even angles down. That's awesome. It's like, hey, danger, you're about to go into the Badlands. Watch out. It's, it's so good. So yeah, check out the Discord. We, we do stuff in Creations, the DYS Creations channel, the modding channel. And I believe once Matt is back from his little mini vacation, he's the, that's the developer, he's going to work on coming up with like more of like a forum for the modding because we've got literally hundreds hundreds and hundreds of files you name it there's i mean there's so much on there that it's it's honestly becoming kind of a pain to sift through it all so hopefully that gets done thanks for watching everyone